Okay, hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be doing a, or actually this week rather, I'm gonna be doing a what I wore this week again. And once again, sponsored by Nasty Gal. So I just like to do this because it's like more vlog style, you know what I mean? So you get to see my new life in Ohio. <laughs> so anyway, okay, I'm just gonna, um, I'm getting ready right now because I'm going to the grocery store because I am having to drive all the way across town to get Parmesan, <laughs> so nice. Yeah, I'm having to get vegan Parmesan, so I'm driving like way far to go get that. But I'm doing it with a smile on my face. So anyway, I probably should show you. I'll just show you what I'm wearing and then I'm just gonna put on a little bit of mascara and maybe some, what is this called? Lip stuff and then we'll be heading out the door. I have my cotton candy flavored water in here, which is like, it's 7 a.m. I shouldn't be doing this, but I have my sunglasses on, really cute. And then I have this random grapefruit shirt, but it's just cute. Like it's just, you know, it's the style these days. It's the style. So then I'm wearing sweat shorts and they're in this really fun maroon color. I felt like this was a nice little juxtaposition. If you know what I mean. I probably should like roll these sleeves up, but I'll do it later. I'm just wearing, honestly, I'm trying to buy like clothes and you'll see in this haul. I'm just getting clothes that are like, I don't know, clothes that I would wear, actually wear. <sighs> Inspired by my last haul that I did because I just did a haul where I was like, oh, you know what? I like this haul because I actually feel like I'm gonna wear these clothes. <laughs> and not that I like don't wear my other clothes, but I don't really wear my other clothes. Cause like I, I have like these lofty dreams of like reinventing myself and hitting the road and becoming a, you know, the Devil Wears Prada basically. And then all of a sudden I'm like, wait a minute. No. So that's as good as it's gonna get for right now. But I am just gonna spray with this Milani Make It Last sunscreen or whatever, SPF 30. Love the fit. Okay, I did my hair. I put more makeup on because it just looked so bad before. I was like, where did this self tanner come from? On the middle of my hand. No less, but anyway, I put more makeup on because I just looked so awful, but okay, this is my setup. I feel very proud, by the way. So I have my laptop, which I stream from, camera. I have a wireless mic, which I'm about to hook up to myself. Let's see if this turns on. So yeah, I have a, <laughs> I have a wireless mic, which I'm going to be connecting. I feel like I'm on a TV show. I mean, I honestly feel like I'm on a TV show. This is so hilarious and cool. You can see, I mean, it's kind of legit, honestly. For setting it up and it takes like five minutes or so, kind of legit. Today I'm making green pea pesto linguine. I think I already said that, but I don't remember, to be honest with you. So anyway, wow, she fancy, huh? Okay, a good morning. So, it's the next day. And this morning we're going grocery shopping for real. So I have my favorite thing that ever happened to me, which is, well, not really, but it's this like meal planner. It looks like this. So what you do, I think I've showed this before, I'm not sure, but it says things to prepare and then you meal plan every single meal. And then what I like to do is I like to write down like literally every single I, like how to make it like what is required so for example I make Jarvis chickpea wraps for lunch every day for work so 
It's chickpeas, it's mayo, buffalo, lemon, garlic, celery, green onion, spinach, and then a wrap. So then after I've like written out everything, right? So you have breakfast, lunch, dinner, snack. You go over and you start to make your grocery list, which looks like this. So you have produce section, grains and bread, meat and fish, which obviously, you know, uh, dairy and eggs, and then at the bottom you have other section. So what's nice is you can go and be like, okay, breakfast is oatmeal and strawberries. So then you put like in produce, you put strawberries and then you put oatmeal in the grains and bread. Obviously it's organized and you, that way you're not over buying anything because you've already planned your meals out and you're saving money. But what's really nice, I feel like I've explained this before. So if I have, oh well, but um, what's, I think what's nice is that when I'm in the produce section, I'm not like, what I always do is I'll go, I'm not like efficient shopper. So I'll forget something and then I'll have to walk all the way back. And I'm already like in the back of the store. I'm like, oh shoot, I forgot my produce, all my produce items. So it's nice because I'm like, okay, I'm, I'm gonna get strawberries, lemons, grapes, spinach, green peppers, all right here. And then I can move on to the next one. And you know how everything in the store is pretty much grouped up like by produce, grains, meat, fish, you know, it's all in the same section. So it's nice that way. I started to write my list out on like a regular notepad. And then I was like, never mind. So anyway. I'm gonna show you my outfit for grocery shopping. I'm wearing this gorgeous color. The, it's uh, the moon, it's just a big like oversized tee, or like I bought it that way. I think I'm gonna get it where it's actually like not oversized. But anyway, so I'm wearing this big oversized tee and then I'm just wearing like gray shorts. These are also from Nasty Gal. They're just like the gray sort of sweat shorts. They're just long line, they're high waisted too. It's a simple shopping outfit but oh my god like just the color of this is so gorgeous but these are like so comfortable cute love it fun we'd love to see that okay well anyway i'm gonna go to the grocery store so What's up everybody? Today is Monday, I think. I don't even remember where I've been in this video, but right now I am sitting down showing you the behind the scenes <laughs> of me editing a video. So I'm sitting down in my comfy clothes. Okay, so I just got these from Nasty Gal. It's really cute. Gingham is my favorite print. So anyway, it's like this pajama set though, but it's just like a really light fabric perfect for sleeping because all i do is sweat when i sleep but it also comes with a matching little scrunchie actually the one that i'm wearing is not the one that is the matching one because i misplaced that one <laughs> but i just kind of threw one in that looked like it because it comes with a gingham scrunchie so it's like a three-piece let me stand up it's like a three-piece little like set or whatever but it comes with a it's supposed to come with a gingham scrunchie it's so adorable and i saw it online by the way i think it was like seven bucks <laughs> so we love those prices but yeah anyway i just wanted to like fill you in on what i'm doing today because this is what i do so yeah anyway i'm just working on this uh vlog it's like not it's not exciting content it's gonna be like basically me testing ice cream flavors like okay really really good so a lot of a lot of stuff going on over on the vlog channel <laughs> but i am editing my moving vlog so i have like i'm trying to get through the moving stuff because a lot of people don't even know that i've moved that's how like behind that i am and we moved almost like what was it not a month ago but it's almost been like it's been three weeks since we moved so after i'm done editing this though i'm gonna start making dinner and dude my cooking since i we moved to ohio has been insane and i'm not just trying to brag about myself i have other people who can vouch i don't know what happened but like it really like stepped up i think it's just because i'm going to the store finally and not getting 
Amazon Prime <laughs> delivery. <laughs> I was getting Amazon Prime delivered to me and like basically what was happening is they were picking out my produce and like their produce is not that great. So now that I'm actually going out picking out good bell peppers, good onions, you know, like, you know, it makes a huge difference. Plus I'm shopping at a store that has like a really good produce department because I shop at Meijer now. And I love it, by the way. So I've been making fajitas, which I'm gonna make tonight. Oh my God, it's just, everything's tasting better. I've been buying fresh lemons, fresh limes. I'm telling you, it makes all the difference. And then let me just show you this because I'm very excited and it's all I talk about. If you've talked to me in the last maybe week, you know that I've been on the hunt for this olive oil. This olive oil is recommended by Ina Garden, who is my, the only person that I truly idolize. And it's called Oleo Santo, and it's from California. It's a cold pressed extra virgin olive oil, also known as an EVOO. And last night I used it, this cost me 20 bucks. <laughs> last night I used it, and let's just say, it's freaking good. Even Jarvis said to me, he's like, whoa, what'd you do differently? I'm like, oh, it's just a little EVO. Hope you enjoyed the outfit. Really cute, link down below if you like what I'm wearing. <laughs>
really cute. So, okay, let's go to Dollar Tree and then I also have to go to Kroger, which is, I've never been to a Kroger, so we'll see. Okay, here's my new outfit. Denim jeans. Oh my God, these shoes are so cute. I love them. Okay, anyway. So I have to go to Kroger for, I've been looking everywhere for light life bacon, smart bacon specifically. And there's like, I don't know. I mean, I haven't really tried a lot of other vegan like alternatives necessarily for bacon, but I just know that the, the smart light life smart bacon is to me the best bacon. So I don't really want to look for anything else because that's to me what I like. So I don't know. I mean, it's fun for me. I have nothing else to do. So I'm just, just going to drive all over the place for like specific items, but, um, I've never been to Kroger, so I'm excited to see like what is going on with that place and what the haps is. And I'll give you my full review, but it's crazy. I've been, I feel like I've been so productive today because I woke up, I make Jarvis his lunch for work every day. I mean, I make his chickpea wrap. I make it the night before, but I like put everything together the next morning. So I'm up at like 6.30 anyway. So I've just, I've started to go to the gym at like 7.30ish and I'm done by what, 8.30 and then I get back and I shower and then I'm ready to go by nine basically. So then I have my whole day, like right now it's only 10.30 and I've already went to the gym, did everything, I um, got ready, and I uploaded a vlog. So, at, like, finished the edit on it, uploaded it, which takes a little while, and then made a thumbnail, and it's up. So, I feel very productive. But you know what's crazy is living here is the time change. It's, like, insane. Just being on Eastern time, I feel, like, so insanely productive because... There, I feel like there's some psychological element that I've been missing my whole life by living now that I live in the Eastern time zone where I feel like I'm ahead of other people. And I know that might seem crazy because it's only one hour and I was previously living in central time zone, but I honestly feel like I'm ahead of everybody. Like I am, it makes me feel extra motivated because I don't feel like I'm having to come back and like I'm behind or whatever. So, yeah, anyway, I mean, I know that's like literally insane, but no, it isn't insane actually. It, it makes sense. <sighs> what do I need to get at Dollar Tree? I don't even know why I'm going there. I felt like I, I always feel like I need to go there for some reason and then I show up and I'm like, I don't know. I mean, I have been looking for these candy jars for kind of a long time. Okay, that person just cut across. Like, what are you doing? But I have been looking for these candy jars for like ever, so. Maybe they'll be there today, I don't know. If they're not, they're not, but yeah. So anyway, cool. Love my outfit. By the way, do you guys remember this bag? Such a great bag. Um, so yeah, I that's from Nasty Y'all, so I'll try to link it. Hopefully it's still there. Let me turn the music off, hello. Sorry, I have to have the air on because it's literally that hot, but I found these and I have to try them because I could not believe my eyes. So it's acai and blueberry from Dollar Tree. <laughs> so it's completely vegan. I don't even know why, but it is. So I'm gonna do a little taste test because I'm hungry. Dark chocolate acai. Oh my God, these might be so good. I knew it. That's always a good combo, you know? Because sometimes, like, acai is too sweet, you know? But a lot of the time, dark chocolate's too bitter, you know? Am I, am I really explaining this to people, or do I just have nothing else to say? Hey guys, what's up? Today is Thursday, and it's the last day I'm doing what I wore this week. I just got back um, from the gym and doing my morning routine. Today I did like 40 minutes on the bike and then, and I read on my Kindle, so obviously I wasn't working that hard. <laughs> and then I did like an arm workout circuit. So 
Anyway, I just wanted to show you really quick. What, Bill? What do you need? He froze up. <laughs> um, I just want to show you what I'm wearing really quick. So, because um, I have a couple activities. So this is like really boring. And I literally wear this sweatshirt every time I do anything. It's my favorite sweatshirt. I don't know, it's like the way that it fits. I just, I kind of love it. So it's just this Nasty Gal one. It's the Kyoto one. It's always on their best sellers. Literally always on their best sellers. It goes in and out of stock all the time. And I just, it's probably the crew neck. Of all my crew necks, in which I have many, as many people know, this is probably the one that I wear the most. I don't know what happened, but I just, I just like it. And then I'm wearing this Columbus Clippers hat because it's cute. It looks vintage. I got it at the game when I went two weeks ago. I'm wearing these also from Nasty Gal, just these like, you know, sweatshorts again. Love it. Love it, love it. Really comfortable. I was going to wear like this really f fancy outfit today because I have to go to the store again because I have to go to Walmart and get these waters that my dad likes because they're coming and then I had to get something else too I don't know but oh I had to get I want to get 4th of July t-shirts for we're going to a Cincinnati Reds game I was gonna get 4th of July shirts because it's over 4th of July weekend so anyway today though I just had to order more stamps because I lost my stamps in the move and I had like 30 stamps but we got like another wave of wedding gifts <laughs> so I had to order more thank you cards did I ever show you I think I showed my vlog channel but I don't think if you watch this channel only you would not have seen them but they're really cute so they just look like this they're blank and I got them from rifle paper co they're so cute I ordered them directly from the website so these are the cards that I sent out as thank yous it's just so cute Everything from Rifle Paper Co. It's like so cute. So anyway, I got this and then in every single one of them I put a Polaroid of us using my little Instax uh, printer. So this is the photo I put. Not this one, but something similar. Like I just put this little picture in every single one of my thank yous so everybody can put it in their fridge and just look at me all day. <laughs> just kidding, but I wanted to show you because this is the last thing I don't know like I promise I'll stop talking but um, I wanted to show you though. This is like one of the best gifts that I ever got and I use it every single day. It actually replaced my toaster. I don't even use my toaster anymore I use this for literally everything. Okay and this was one of my wedding gifts from my uh, friend Madison and who also happened to be my parents neighbors um, so I love this. It's obviously been used. I need to clean this tray out. Like, yikes. But it's this Breville toaster oven. I don't know what kind it is, but it's got all these different, like, settings. Bagel, toast, bake, whatever. And I just, I love it. I genuinely love it. I don't know. And you could do, like, the temperature, and it's, like, it's nice. It's digital. It's not, you know what I mean? It's like, oh, I love it so much. You could do the time. I just love it. I love it. It's my favorite thing that I got. Probably my favorite gift, and I hate to choose, but that probably was my favorite gift. So anyway, just wanted to show you that. So I'm going to begin working on doing like the last of my thank yous. I just have a couple more to send out. And then I'm going to probably go put those in the mailbox, and then I'm going to go to the store today. So just wanted to show you what I was wearing you know, I was gonna like be fake <laughs> and wear something that I like totally never was like gonna wear, you know, and like dress up to go to like Walmart. And I was just like, why would I do that? Like, it just doesn't make any sense. So uh, this is what I would actually wear to the store and what I am gonna wear to the store today. Cause it's, ra it's a rainy day. I'm just, I'm not gonna get dressed up. I did have a cute outfit, but I'll just have to show you in the next video or something. So, all right, you guys, anyway, so I'm not gonna bore you anymore with like all the stuff that I'm doing today, but I wanna say thanks again for Nasty Gal for sponsoring this fun vlog. If you like these kind of videos, leave a like. And if you liked anything that I showed in this video, any outfit, any t-shirt, the moon t-shirt that was pink and gorgeous, who could forget? Uh, anything at all, I'll link it down below. Those are affiliate links, so I get a commission when you use them. So I appreciate that in advance if you do. But anyway, I will see y'all in the next video.